because the teachers felt like they needed it. Um, my understanding, now I wasn't here to observe it, but my understanding was that the standard of dress had gotten so out of, um, out of whack, so to speak, that the teachers felt it was a distraction. Um, I worked at another school where there was no dress code, and one of the things I dealt with as an assistant principal who was in charge of discipline, the assistant principals do most of the discipline usually, is we had a lot of sexual harassment um, based on what kids were wearing. And unfortunately, it always comes back to what the girls are wearing. Um, it's not fair, but it, it's a reality that girls would wear certain things that may have been revealing or um, may, and, and it sounds like they're, by wearing it, they're asking for it, which isn't what I want to convey, but certain outfits that they wore um, created a situation where guys would make inappropriate statements. Sorry about that. Um, and there, there was a distraction to the learning environment um, based on what some of the folks were wearing at school. I honestly, I don't think it's fair. And I think only certain teachers enforce it because lots of teachers don't agree with it so they don't enforce it as much. No, I do not think the dress code is fair or consistently enforced. Uh, lots of times teachers won't uh, send students down for dress code issues just because they understand that you know, it's harder for us to find clothes or a dress code or they think it's a little crazy.